education is the key. It's been the key in this country and in the world forever. We could reasonably provide 6,500 pre-K slots uh, to three and four year olds in our city uh, over a four year period. We see um, an amazing reaching of their potential um, as, as, little, as little human beings uh, moving into the next level of their educational lives. If you are reading at grade level by third and fourth grade, you're gonna be successful. If you're not, you're not gonna be. In seventh and eighth grade, you are embarrassed because basically you can't read. So you start acting up to get attention. By eighth and ninth grade, if it, nothing's changed and nothing will change, uh, you're dropping out. Uh, and if we can stop that from happening when the child is three, um, we're going to spend a lot less money on all kinds of ills that come about as a result of not being educated. The more positive impact that kids have from adults towards them, the better off they are. Take the time and energy and effort and resources to invest in them and to show them that their lives matter, that they matter, uh, and that there's a future for them. I can't tell you the number of times that I've gone into a pre-K or to a kindergarten or a first grade and you spend 15, 20 minutes with them and talk to them and listen to what they're doing and have them show you things and that light is still there. And when they come over and hug you, it is impactful. And if you can continue to keep that light alive their whole life, we're going to have a wonderful cohort of young men and women who are successful, professional, educated uh, and contributors to our society.